23 years ago, Shanley showed up uninvited to my house. <laughs> my parents said that we had to keep her, and I'm thankful that we did because being her big sister has been one of the best journeys that I have been on in my life. As someone who has loved Shanley all of her life, there is such a sense of security knowing that she found someone who makes her feel just as loved as we always did at 25 Wilson Ave. When Nick pulled Shanley over, our lives changed forever. <laughs> he met her and knew that this was the drama queen that he needed in his life. And like always in the Burke household, we immediately said, Tag, you're it. Nick is kind and easygoing, and for those of you unrelated to us, our family is a bit much. So to come in wholeheartedly takes a lot. Nick is a ridiculously patient man to be able to handle Shanley, which is the perfect addition for our family because we've never had one of those before. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Shanley is dependable and beautiful inside and out. Nick, you might as well have hit the jackpot on the green machine with this one. As someone who has loved Shanley all of her life, there is such a sense of security knowing that she found someone who makes her feel just as loved as we always did at 25 Wilson Ave. So at Nick's uh, his bachelor party, it's about two in the morning. We're all getting ready for bed. We've been pretty pretty drunk, been drinking. And uh, he's got his own bed, and I got my own bed. And he rolls over to me, looks me with his big brown eyes right in the face, and he goes, "Man, I miss her." <laughs> I go, "What?" <laughs> so it <laughs> doesn't end there. He, he decides at that time, two in the morning, I'm gonna call her. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna call Shanley. He calls her and she answers, Shanley answers. She goes, Nick, what are you doing? It's two in the morning. He goes, I just wanna tell you I love you. Um, and he, he sincerely meant it, I was watching. So, and she said it back and you know, I, I smile, but now looking back at it and seeing it for what it is, you know, they, they really do love each other. Um, they always got each other's back. They're always looking out for each other. So um, I know the best is yet to come for those two. And congratulations, guys. It's awesome. So, My advice to you, my forever best friend, is to give space when needed, but please don't take everything off the walls this time. <laughs> Nick always told me he wasn't going to get married, and that was dead, like, Every single time I asked, are you gonna get married? Are you gonna have kids? Never, never. I can't believe you lied to me. <laughs> Nick, it's an honor and a privilege to be your brother and your best man. Chanley, welcome officially to the family. I love you both. My advice for my best friend since pre-K is when you decide to get pregnant, don't hide it from us for six months like you did with Nick. If you even put half the effort in your marriage as you did trying to beat me in racquetball or trying to hit a baseball off me, you'll have nothing but success. You've been one hell of a friend and I wish you and your beautiful bride the best future possible. When the day comes you add to your family, I pray for a healthy little girl as I know you need a daughter. <laughs> Cheers to you both. So please raise your glass and let's all toast to the Belials. <laughs> Rain or shine, I'll cover you up and calm the sky. Nick, from the second you pulled me over and gave me my first police scare, I knew you were the one. From day one, you have been my calm, my comfort, my best friend. I've never in my life felt a place where I feel so safe and calm like I do when I'm with you. And you instantly take my worries away and provide me with endless love. You have allowed me to bloom and grow alongside you as a person and as a couple. You are the most hardworking, selfless, driven, hilarious, kind-hearted man, and I'm so lucky to call you my husband. Shanley, I could say a million words right now and still not be able to fully express how much I love you. I'm making the easiest decision of my life, choosing me to marry you. 
I can, I can never fully wrap my head around the fact that I get to marry the girl of my dreams. You're the most caring, compassionate, and loving person that I have ever met. My heart still pounds in my chest when you walk into the room. When you are around, it feels like a weight is lifted off my back. You are my rock, my soulmate, and my best friend. As I stand before you, I want to tell you that I have no hesitation, no apprehension, and complete confidence in spending the rest of my life with you. I promise to love you unconditionally until my last breath, and I wanted to thank you for showing me what true love is. Tear that falls free.